Alright, so boom, yesterday I discovered Fair Play, aka Discount Dudley, and I thought it was just circumstance that he wasn't wearing the suspenders. Turns out this man evolves into a different form every single round. Let's fight like gentlemen. You have no dignity. Gutter trash. In this skirmish here, Fair Play's got on the suspenders, so this must be his first form. And he's taking on a brother built like a mobile human washing machine. It's Chucko Bad Block. With all due respect, you're simply too weak for me. Let's show a little propriety, shall we? Straight out the gate, looks like Discount Dudley Fair Play trying to set up a combo, but for whatever reason, Chucko picked up the controller that was connected to NBA 2K. He's boxing out in a boxing fight. Does your rudeness know no bounds, sir? They're pretty pathetic for a former champ. Think you can make it to the end of the round? You'll have to do better than that. I'm not sure what Chucko's strategy here is, because Fair Play don't got to do much. He pulled up to the fight dressed like he just got done listening to a sermon from Malcolm X, and now he's trying to convert Chucko with some sort of evangelism by fist. You shall learn the teachings of the Nation of Islam. Body blow hawk screw blow you classless oaf somebody should have told chucko to get in shape for this fight fair play hasn't taken a deep breath the entire fight chucko breathing so hard you seeing dust and rocks coming off the ground you're an embarrassment to boxing perhaps it's time to hang up your gloves for good you make a horrible sparring partner but i quit i quit wait a minute ain't no way that fat son of a bitch just forfeited the fight Fair Play didn't even need to evolve into another form. You're simply too weak for me. Ready to throw in the towel? May we continue now? I'll take you on. Well then, let's begin. Is that it? Get serious. Your fighting demeans us both. Kick! Kick! Do it again. Kick! Kick! Gutter trash. Surely you're capable of better. Fight just started for Fair Play versus Adam. Man's decided to start the fight in his final form. Either they had pre-existing bad blood or this is a laundry day. Alex out here dressed like a closeted sailor. Hiya! Coke and kick! <sighs> Bruce, get away! Coke and kick! Stop hitting me! Do it again! Final form fair play is ruthless. Find Jim. Homie been on his back so long, I'm surprised the doctors haven't administered an epidural shot. Don't make me break your arm. Arm bar. <laughs> Bruce. Fair play decided to showcase his versatility, applying an arm bar in a series of different ground moves. But look how disappointed he is by his opponent. Gutter trash. Surely you're capable of better. One more. Not finished just yet. You're simply too weak for me. Given fair play is a millennial, he'll do what millennials do best when you've got your opponent bested. Teabag him before the fight's over! What the fuck is that smell? My balls! How did you know? For the remainder of the round, Fair Play would treat Adam like a defenseless centipede at a bar mitzvah. He could have finished them off at any time, but he showed mercy. Let's fight like gentlemen. Round two, fight. Time to finish off this round. My stomach hurts. Coke and kick! Coke and kick! Simpleton. What? I quit! I quit! God damn, beat that boy like he stole his 64 pack of crayons with the sharpener in second grade. You have no dignity. Is that truly all you're capable of? Another inevitable victory. <laughs> Adam walked into the second round begging to get finished. I've never seen a fighter stand there and leave himself open from every possible strike. You would have thought Fair Play activated the spell card Stop Attack. Had Adam looking like a quadriplegic at a prosthetic giveaway. He getting all the hands and feet. <laughs> He cooked that man, your winner, fair play again. No dinner for Adam. The winner's purse and all of the Hello Fresh goes to fair play. She finna, she finna eat. And now a word from our sponsors. The summer's upon us and I know you're gonna be eating good outside, but it's only right that you eat good inside with Hello Fresh. Today I'm making beef flowers supreme and it's gonna be better than anything I could've got at fast food. Hello Fresh delivers fresh quality produce straight from the farm to your doorstep so you can savor summer flavors right from home. You get to choose from 55 weekly options featuring seasonal pre-portioned ingredients picked at peak ripeness. They've got seasonal recipes ranging from the taste of summer series like the Old Bay Shrimp and Sausage Boil 
grill the family grilled steak, lettuce wraps, and so much more. And HelloFresh allows you to customize your box by swapping out one protein or a side for another, upgrading for a more luxe experience, or adding a protein to a veggie meal. You've got more choices, more variety, and more meals truly tailored to you. What I love the most about HelloFresh is that I can save so much time with foolproof step-by-step -step recipes that creates a joyful cooking experience and a stress-free summer. On average, HelloFresh cuts back on time spent in the kitchen with meals ready in around 30 minutes. And with the pre-portioned ingredients means less prep time for you and less wasted food. HelloFresh is up to 72% cheaper than dining at a restaurant or grocery shopping. Plus, if you want to go green, look no further than HelloFresh. They're the first carbon neutral meal kit company and nearly all its packaging is recyclable. So let me help you eat right this summer. Click the link in my description and go to HelloFresh.com and use code CHISELED16 for up to 16 free meals and three surprise gifts. Let them know I sent you. And now back to your regularly scheduled program. I'll take you on. Well then, let's begin. Next fight, it's Fair Play versus Afro Samurai. Looks like Oprah must have let him go following the pandemic. Bushido Brown out here became a freelance fighter. Boondocks vs. Street Fighter was a crossover episode I never expected to see, but I never wanted more. Get serious. Gotcha. Don't let your guard down. That's nothing. Huh. Yeah. Too slow. Prepare yourself. Go on then. <clears throat> this is too easy. You asked for it. Keep it classy. Yo! Left hand almost split his afro in half. Time to finish off this round. Barely double. Oh lord, fair play looking to turn off his console. Oh, I missed. Excellent. Beautiful. I'm impressed. Time to finish off this round. Rolling. Thunder. <laughs> Corkscrew. Blow. <laughs> the end. Oh, Lord. The corkscrew blow got this man laying on the ground like he overdosing on opium. Do you want to continue or not? I can't. I, I simply can't. Game over. Finish. He caught so much red from them gloves, he might turn grip. Afro Thunder's therapy session gonna be crazy. What's the last thing you remember? Red Everlast? I'll take you on. Well then, let's begin. Fresh out the barber shop, it's Fair Play versus the Iraqi Assassin. <laughs> The two-piece had the Iraqi assassin playing a poor man's version of Twister. Left leg, right hand on dirt. Your extravagant movements are merely wasteful. Into the final round, Fair plays in his final form. He's shirtless. So what are you gonna do now, big boy? Oh shit. The left hand caught the Iraqi assassin so fast he didn't even know he was hit. Look at that knot under his left eye. Fair play made his face pregnant. The fight would continue, but the damage was already done. Fair play's hands are like cell solar flare. The Iraqi assassin can't even see. What's the matter? Damn it! <gasps> you missed me! I've never been so humiliated in my life! You're the one who started this game, and now you don't want to play anymore? By the conclusion of the fight, Fair Play looked like he just got done with an intense cardio session, but the Iraqi assassin looked like his eyes in the third trimester. I'll take you on. Well then, let's begin. Wait a minute! Shut the fuck up. Damn, why Fair Play got so much smoke for Hayden? He's penetrating his neck. Is that the fourth hole? Quagmire was wrong. Giggity, 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 let's have sex. Hayden is trying to block with his face. Hiya! No! Help me! Help me! For 10 seconds, the moment they got off the floor, Hayden was getting his ass whipped. He's got to be feeling all kinds of blunt force trauma right now. They had to call a timeout. I've had it. Everyone's getting a timeout. <laughs> Enough of this shit. Finish him. Kick. Think you can make it to the end of the round? You'll have to die. <gasps> you missed me. Time to finish off this round. OK, Hayden, using the Uno reverse. <laughs> Cock and kick. Cock screw blow. One. Two, three, the end. Two, strong. Victory is mine. Damn, following the timeout, Hayden got his ass whipped. Fair play hit that man with a barrage of strikes you can't even find in a bowling alley. This kick almost sent Hayden to the upper room, but fair play decided it's hands that's gonna take him to the shadow realm. Finish him. <laughs> It's time.
time to hang up your gloves for good. You make a horrible sparring partner. You have no dignity. Is that truly all you're capable of? You mean to tell me you watched the entire video but you haven't subscribed? Hit the subscribe button and become a member on Patreon or on YouTube to get access to the Discord. We're waiting for you in the Shadow Realm. Do it! Just do it! Make your dreams come true! Please! Please! What are you waiting for, huh? Oh my god.